Hey, what's going on guys? My name is The Wolf Praise and welcome back to another episode of Insane Besiege Creations. Today I plan to show you guys some more of the most awesome creations that I have found on the Steam Workshop and to start off with, this creation's name is called Minecraft Sword. This is basically a throwable sword and uh, we'll just go ahead and take a nice little look all around here so you guys can get a nice picture of this thing. Uh, it actually looks pretty cool, you know, it has a nice little wooden handle here and uh, as you guys see these bands here, that is how it actually launches itself. So let's go ahead and launch it here and uh, see how we do it. There we go. Uh, this isn't full speed with zero gravity, just so you guys do know here. Okay, and it looks like it's actually going to hit this guy. Here we go. Okay, and there's also a way to spin the sword, so let's go ahead and do that. There we go. Get wrecked, dude. Okay, this time I think we're going to try to hit this guy over here, and uh, maybe we'll actually be able to aim this thing. That's why I mainly want to try is to see if you can actually aim it and, uh, you know, all that good stuff. Okay, let's go ahead and launch it here and uh, see how we do it. Okay, let's go ahead and get rid of that. There we go. Okay, let's go ahead and launch this bad boy, and uh, we'll go ahead and start spinning it as well. Here we go. Okay, it might be a little bit low. But, you know, that's not too bad. Here we go. Yeah, this isn't uh, full speed, as I said, though, so it does look really slow, but it's actually going in full speed here. There we go. Get wrecked, dude. That was pretty cool. And uh, as you guys see there, the whole entire sword uh, split apart there. That was actually really awesome. Okay. Okay, this time, let's try to aim up for the tower over here, and then we might actually go to a real map and see if we can actually take down a castle with this thing. Uh, you know, I don't really know for sure if we'll be able to, but it might be fun. So there we go. Let's go ahead and try to aim this up down here. We just have to go a little bit lower, I think. There we go. And uh, we'll go ahead and rotate this up. Uh, that looks pretty lined up. I think it'll be okay. Let's go ahead and try it there and uh, see if we can make this. Here we go. We'll go ahead and start spinning it as well. So that'll kind of help us out, I think. Here we go. Get wrecked, tower. Oh, oh, whoa. Okay, and uh, we just barely flew over the top of it. That was like, there was like an inch of space there. I don't know how that happened. And uh, now the sport's just kind of like spinning out of control and it just blew apart. That, that was really cool though. I really love this creation. I don't know why. It's just really simple, but it's also really fun. It's, it's hard to explain. Let's go ahead and go to a real map and see how it does there. Okay, this is uh, apparently where we spawn on the Duke's Police. So let me go ahead and, uh, you know, get ourselves positioned over here somewhere. Oh, what happened there? Okay, buddy, uh, just calm down. Okay, I want you to go this way. Why, why are you? Oh, okay, that, that's fine too. Okay, I think this might actually work. Let's go ahead and set that down on the ground. And uh, we'll go ahead and rotate this a little bit. Go ahead and turn off the bounding box. Where, there we go. Okay, let's go ahead and try this here and uh, see if this actually works. Oh, I forgot to turn on zero gravity. There we go. Okay, and uh, let's go ahead and try this here. Oh, I might have to reset it. Let's go ahead and do that there. Okay, here we go. Let's go ahead and try this uh, versus the Duke's plea. As all the knights start to fly up there, let's go ahead and see if we can hit them. There we go. Get wrecked, dudes. And yes, we went all the way through the tower there. Again, we're not in invincibility mode, so that was pretty cool. And uh, there goes the tower kind of floating up into the air, and the sword's just kind of freaking out over here. That's fine. Okay, let's go ahead and try that again. All right, this time I'm going to try to move it a little bit farther away. Okay, yeah, it isn't actually glitching out this time, so it should be okay. Here we go. Okay, and uh, maybe we'll move it. Okay, no, that's fine right here. Okay, let's go ahead and try this again here, and uh, see how we do. Let's go ahead and start spinning it here. Okay, there we go. Ooh, okay, that's absolutely beautiful. I don't know why. Uh, this creation is just really cool. It's really simple, but it's also really awesome, and it works really well as well. I definitely recommend you guys check it out for yourself down below in the description, as well as all the other creations from today's episode. Let's go ahead and move on to the next creation. Okay, and for the next creation of today's episode, this creation's name is called Gregory. Now, there isn't really anything else about the creation here. There's no other pictures or anything with the controls, uh, but you know, it looks really cool, and uh, yeah, with a name like Gregory, it has to be pretty cool. Okay, let's go ahead and try to figure out what we can do here. Okay, we can move forward and back feet here. Okay, that's it. Oh, I get it. It's kind of like uh, like the swinging thing to knock down a door. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, just roll up to the castle here and see how we do. Uh, and it has a nice little bomb on it there, so let's go ahead and uh, we'll stop right there, and uh, hopefully it'll swing into it. There we go. Okay, uh, th this isn't quite working. Come on, buddy. Just, you know, just go through the tower. That's all I want. You know, just right, right through. Here we go. Okay, there has to be a button to explode this thing. I mean, otherwise, it's just... I don't know. It looks really cool, and I love the way that it works. I just think that it's a bomb strapped on the front. It might not even be a bomb, and I might just be wrong with that. Uh, let's go ahead and just try this again here, and uh, see if maybe we can just knock it down. I don't know. Here we go. Go into it as fast as possible, and, uh, you know, stop right there, and uh, hit it. There we go. And uh, just do a little bit of this maneuver, and, uh, yeah, it, it doesn't seem like it's working. Uh, maybe we can actually, like, hit the actual door here, and uh, we could probably knock that out. Here we go. Come on, get wrecked door. There we go. Nice. Okay. Uh, but yeah, I thought this was actually going to explode, and uh, I pressed it pretty much every other button on my keyboard here. Oh, there's some different camera modes here. Okay, those are pretty cool. Um, yeah, I, but yeah, again, I don't really know what we can do here. Um, let me go ahead and take this thing off the front, and we'll go ahead and put a bomb on it anyway. Okay, I should just be able to use a pin block here. I, I'm not exactly sure, though, because, you know, I don't I, I don't build in Besiege very often. If you guys would like to see an episode of me building and trying to go through the levels, make sure to leave a like down below or a comment, and, uh, yeah, I'll try that out as well. Okay, let's go ahead and try this here. Maybe that'll stick. Okay, it didn't. 20 minutes later. Okay, I'm going to try just to throw a grab around here, and if this doesn't work, we'll just go ahead and move on. Uh, but yeah, I at least want to try something with this, because, you know, I think a bomb on this thing would be really cool okay let's go ahead and try okay there we go uh, does it actually go swing yes it is beautiful okay all right this is actually working let's go ahead and get rid of the ui there okay here we go um oh 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 
now I'm stuck in place. Oh, it's because of that pin block I put in. Okay, let's go ahead and get rid of that pin block there. Okay, we should be good now. All right, let's let's go ahead and try this. Okay, this looks like it's working. Okay, let's go ahead and try this here and uh, ram it to the ball here. And oh, okay, yes, that was absolutely beautiful. And that uh, took down the entire castle there, uh, even though you know our creation is kind of on fire now. Uh, but yeah, that was absolutely cool. Uh, yeah, this creation is definitely really cool. I definitely recommend you guys check it out for yourself down below in the description. Uh, you know, it comes with like the spike ball, but as you guys see there, you can put a grabber on and use the bomb, and uh, it works really well. Okay, and for our next creation of today's episode, this creation's name is called the Attack Mono Wheel. This thing is super cool, as you guys see here. Uh, it's kind of like a motorcycle inside of this wheel thing here. And there's all kinds of weapons strapped all over it, and uh, yeah, it's just absolutely awesome. Uh, let's go ahead and check out the different camera modes first to start off with. And uh, here we go. There's a nice little cockpit view from the side there. Okay, and a nice little back camera as well. And uh, there's also a nice little uh, aiming camera. Let's go ahead and try this here and uh, see how we do. Okay, I'm not exactly sure what kind of weapon this is. It's either a cannon, a flamethrower, a rocket, or a ballistic cannon. Uh, but yeah, let's just go ahead and try it here and uh, see how we do. Okay, let's go ahead and press the cannon button. Okay, yeah, it does a cannon. Beautiful. Okay, let's go ahead and take a nice little couple more shots here. You guys know how it is. Get wrecked, dudes. Here we go. That's pretty cool. Okay, let's go ahead and try out some of the rockets as well. Okay, and the rockets are over here. Let's go ahead and do these. Uh, these are one through three. Let's go ahead and do one. There we go. Oh, whoa. Okay, it almost came back to me. Let's go ahead and try to do two. And uh, yeah, they, they seem to come back to me. That's kind of weird. Let's go ahead and try that last one. And uh, yeah, that's, that's really strange. They like come completely straight back to me. Uh, that, that was really weird. We'll just go ahead and ignore that, but, uh, yeah, there's also some flamethrowers. Let's go ahead and try those. There we go. Okay, let's go ahead and, uh, go up to these knights here and see if we can catch them on fire. Come on, buddies. You know, you're just going to get wrecked. That's just how this day goes. That's, that's the end of your story for you, okay? And, uh, it doesn't actually seem like it's, oh, there, oh, oh yeah, okay, it is actually working there. Okay, beautiful. There's a nice little flamethrower. Uh, but yeah, this creation is really cool. Uh, there's also some ballistic cannons. Uh, let's go ahead and try those out as well. Uh, four and six. Whoa, okay, uh, something happened there. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and try six. Okay, and yeah, those only work once. That's really weird, even though I have infinite ammo on. Uh, but yeah, anyways, this creation is absolutely insane. Let's go ahead and uh, go back into the, uh, the uh, aim mode over here. And uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and try this a little bit more. All right, I just want to snipe this little guy over here. And uh, it's a little bit hard to aim side to side, but that should be okay. And uh, let's go ahead and move up just a little bit. And uh, let's go ahead and fire it off and see how we do. Here we go. And, uh, okay, that was a little bit high, and, uh, he got wrecked anyway, so I guess that was a job well done. But yeah, this is definitely a really cool creation. You can tell the creator put a lot of time and effort into it, and, uh, it definitely shows. It's very awesome, and I definitely recommend you guys check it out for yourself down below in the description. But let's go ahead and move on to the next creation. Okay, and this creation's name is called the Giga Transformer. Well, we'll go ahead and take a nice little look all around here so you guys can get a good picture of how this thing looks. Uh, it's supposed to be a car that transforms into a walker, and, uh, as you guys see here, it looks pretty cool just as a car. Uh, let's go ahead and try to drive around a little bit. Here we go. This isn't too bad. We are in 70 percent speed just so you guys do know it's not a very big creation okay let's go ahead and uh, just run over a couple of these knights over here you guys know how it is come on buddy you, you just gotta get wrecked that's how it goes uh this is how this relationship works you guys just get wrecked and uh, i i always win okay but now they're kind of chasing me so let's just go ahead and restart it and, and uh we'll just go ahead and try to transform it here okay and uh first we have to hold one until the num until the drills nearly touch the ground okay let's go ahead and try that here here we go we'll just go ahead and move that there okay oh oh oh, oh. that's that's too far how do we move okay there we go we're good oh okay uh two is to hold h until you extend the drills and cover the face uh let's go ahead and try that there okay i i guess that's it okay and three is to hold comma until the body is upright let's go ahead and try that as well here we go oh this is so cool oh, come on buddy you can do it i believe in you yes oh whoa whoa okay well is that good is, is that okay okay uh number four is to hold numpad one again until the drills are in front of the body here we go that's pretty cool. Okay. And uh, number five is to hold N until he makes a split. Uh, let's go ahead and try that as well. Here we go. Okay. And uh, yeah, he kind of does look like he's doing a little split there. That's cool. Uh, that's pretty cool. Can we actually drive around like this? Um. Okay. No, we can't because these wheels are going sideways here. Okay. Number six is to hold V until he is standing. Here we go. Come on, buddy. Rise. I believe in you. Whoa. Okay. This guy is absolutely insane. Okay. And uh, now what do we do? Uh, you can now move him by holding I and O. Okay. Let's go ahead and try this here. Here we go. It's a little bit of I. This is a little bit of O. Okay, yeah, it's just a nice little uh, flame th or like little jets behind him here. Uh, we can just hold both these and go forward here. This is so freaking cool. Okay, uh, what else can we do here? Whoa. Okay. Whoa. Oh, okay. He just fell. Okay, that's that's probably not good. Okay, apparently he was ice skating there, and uh, yeah, that's what this guy's supposed to be. He's supposed to be a car that transforms into a walker slash ice skater. Okay, let's go ahead and get this guy transformed again. Rise, my child. Rise. Oh, shit, he broke. And I should probably tell you guys, I didn't have it in invincibility mode to start off with there. Uh, so yeah, that was actually pretty good for not even being invincible. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, just finish this guy up here. Okay, it's a little bit too close. There we go. Okay, and uh, then it's just N. Here we go. Do a nice little split and stand up. I think we could do these two at the same time, right? It should be okay. Here we go. And uh, just rise up. Okay, and it also says to press 2 to put the uh, 
like things or put the drills behind your back for better balance here okay let's go ahead and get him all the way back up onto his feet there we go he's good okay let's go ahead and put these back behind him here and uh, this is supposed to be like an ice skater okay let's go ahead and try this a little bit okay I, I forget the controls already oh yeah it's just i and o okay here we go let's go ahead and uh, just aim away from that rock there and uh, see if we can make our way over here uh, maybe we should like try not to go over the hills though because they kind of wrecked us last time here we go this isn't too bad though this is pretty cool okay and uh, what else can we do here uh, transformer controls, I and O, okay, we know that. Oh, we can also, like, raise and lower the shoulders, and, uh, he just falls over, that's fine, whatever. Uh, but you can also move the drills, move the elbows, raise and lower the, uh, the arms, it's just really cool. Oh, there's also some cannons, let's go ahead and try those out as well. And, uh, we'll just go ahead and shoot it from here and see what happens. Okay, they just shoot straight down. I wonder if we can actually, like, shoot this thing like this, you know, he's kind of, like, in the split position, so it's a little bit funnier. Uh, I don't know how we'll be able to aim, though. Maybe we can, like, move these, here we go. Um, that, that's not working too well, though, because these wheels are sideways. Um, it's kind of working though, you know, just, just give him some time. Here we go. Uh, he's making his way. Okay. Yeah. I just don't think that's going to work. Okay. Let's go ahead and uh, just stand this guy back up then. And, uh, we'll go ahead and try to shoot this over at some of these houses over here and, uh, wreck some peasants days. So you guys know how it is. Okay. Let's go ahead and, uh, aim ourselves up. Oh, no, there we go. And, uh, just aim that up over here and, uh, we'll go ahead and shoot these ones over here and, uh, see what we do. Here we go. Yeah, that's pretty cool. And, uh, you know, it, it's just some cannon eyeballs, you know, there's nothing about it, you know, it's, it, it, it's nothing new in Besiege, honestly, okay? Uh, but yeah, this creature is definitely really cool. Uh, it, for a Transformer, it works really well, and it's not too big, so a lot of you guys will probably be able to play as well, because it doesn't take too much of your computer and all that good stuff. Uh, but yeah, it's definitely really cool, I definitely recommend you guys check it out for yourself. But let's go ahead and move on to the last creation of today's episode. Okay, and for the last creation of today's episode, this creation's name is called the Dual Wheel Tank. Uh, this creation is a strange but very stable and strong tank, uh, as the creator says anyway. Uh, let's go ahead and test it out and uh, see how we do on our own. Okay, and uh, to move, we just hold left and right together to go forward. Here we go. First, we'll just go ahead and ram into the tower here and uh, see how we do just with the creation itself. Here we go. This isn't too bad. Curse a couple of knights and uh, just ruin their days. So you guys know how it is. Uh, yeah, we actually took down a nice little bit of the tower there. That's not too bad. Okay, how do we go backward? Uh, just down to go backward? Okay. There we go. Okay, not too bad. Okay, we'll go ahead and check out some of these weapons here. Whoa, okay, there was a knight stuck inside the thing there. Okay, hello, buddy. Uh, but yeah, anyways, there's some different cameras. Let's go ahead and check those out as well. Okay, there's a nice little backwards camera here and a nice little aim camera. We'll go ahead and use this one here. Okay, I accidentally reset it here, so yeah, that's why the tower isn't, like, destroyed or anything. Okay, let's go ahead and try out the anti-personnel weapons first. Okay, this is just an anti-personnel gun. Uh, let's actually get out of this so we can get a nice little picture of what happens here. Okay, we're we'll just going to shoot that off. Oh, okay, they're just like little scatter cannons. Okay, we'll go ahead and actually try that again here. And uh, we'll just move forward up here a little bit. All right, that should be close enough, right? Okay, there we go. Let's go ahead and try this off here. And uh, there we go. Yes, we got uh, took down a couple of them there. And uh, one of them almost landed up on the tower. And one of them actually took out a little bit of the wall there. That's not a very strong wall if, uh, you know, a knight can take it out. But, you know, whatever. Okay, and there's also a 7.5 power tower destroyer cannon. Uh, let's go ahead and try that out. Let's go ahead and go into the aim camera here because I believe this is what it's for here okay and uh, we're going to try to aim this up a little bit and uh, we're just going to shoot it off here we go okay and uh well uh, I, honestly i was expecting a little bit more okay i went ahead and turned infinite ammo on because i didn't have it on for, before for some reason okay let's go ahead and try this again and uh, see if we can you know just take a couple of shots at it here there we go uh yeah it says 7.5 times power tower destroyer cannon i thought it was going to be you know something that just absolutely destroyed it and uh you know th that's still really cool though i'm not yeah i'm not bashing the creation at all it's still very cool for sure and uh, as you guys see here it's very sturdy it hasn't been in invincibility mode uh, and uh there's this little suicidal yak oh he's just gonna chill beside me Okay, hi, hi, buddy. How you doing? Okay, uh, but yeah, this is definitely a really cool creation. Uh, you know, even though the cannon is, it's, it's a little bit underwhelming, okay? I'm not gonna lie, but it's a very cool creation nonetheless, for sure. But if you guys want to check it out for yourself, all of the links for all of these creations will be down below in the description. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching the video today. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you leave a like down below and subscribe to join the pack because we're pretty damn cool around here. If you guys ask me, I'm going to check out some of these other videos from earlier in the week if you guys would like to. It would greatly tickle my heart and make me smile. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys in the next one. Take care and stay awesome, guys.